Hello everyone, I'm back today with another wig review and today is going to be on this hair that I have. This one is going to be a little different from my normal synthetic reviews because this one is a human hair wig. I got this one from wildebony.com. Um, I decided to try something different. This one is an Indian Remy hair wig. Um, this one is 180% density and it's 18 inches long. This one is also a super wavy wig. It's in style number 360 SW02. I paid a total of $194 for this wig. I did use a code the, um, to get $10 off, but the original price was $204 without the code. So this one is actually my favorite wig out of every wig I ever bought or ordered or owned, period. I love this wig. It's Really, really really soft um it came with two combs here one in the middle one in the back with the adjustable draw straps i will show you what the inside looks in a few minutes but this one is really nice it's really easy to style it's really thick really 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 nice let me show you what the wig looks like on each side okay it's pretty long i'm only five three so it'll reach me this is where my pants stuff, but I have high waisted pants also. Um, I guess that doesn't count. But anyway, let me show you what it, what it looks like on each side. This is my right. This is all the hair in the back. And my left side. This hair is really, really pretty. Um, I end up wetting this hair, so that's why it looks like this. I know fall is coming, so Obviously, this may not be in style. This look may not be in style with this wavy, wet look. It's more like a beach style, hairstyle, but I still like it, you know? But, um, of course, you can comb it out. You can hot curl this hair. You can flat iron. You can roll it. You can do whatever you want with this hair. I actually did it once, and I rolled the, the hair, and the curls actually came back once I wet it and washed it. That's the only thing I did. I did wash the hair before I wore it, and... I, I basically like the hair just by wetting it. I don't really have to curl or feel like I have to straighten it. I haven't straightened it yet. I only rolled it, but the curls did come back. I love this wig. So let me show you how I style this wig. Okay, and this is what the wig looks like. Freshly washed and air dry. As you can see, it's pretty long. There are baby hairs in the front also, as you can see, they're pretty long. Okay, and this is the front of the wig. Two combs here and one right in the middle that I never use. And one in the back with the adjustable draw straps. Okay, and I want to come and show you what it looks like up close. The parting space is really, really nice. It has a lot of parting space, as you can see. This wig is from ear to ear. I'm not 100% sure if I mentioned to you, but this is a free plug wig. But in my opinion, it's not plugged enough on the outer edges. And I will have to go in a little bit later and plug the edges really really dense and this clip is just me showing y'all how I style the wig which I didn't do much because I ended up wetting the wig today um, maybe I'll come back later and show you how I curl it but this is basically what I did today
And I want to show y'all what it looks like up close. The edges are big. It's supposed to be pre-plugged, but it really doesn't look like it in my opinion. I'm gonna have to go back and pluck the edges. As you can see, the styling was really, really, really simple. Um, I hardly had to do much to it. Um, I ended up blow drying it because I had somewhere to go. So usually I just take a scarf like this if I'm not going anywhere. If I wanna lay my wigs down and just tie it around my head like this, you know, pretty good to go. This is what the wig looks like on my head up close. I'm not a big fan of a lot of baby hair, so I don't do a lot of laying my hair down, you know, laying the baby hairs down too much. I'm not a big fan of that. So this is what it looks like. It's supposed to be 360, a 360 degree wig, which means you can wear this up in a ponytail. You can push it back and do whatever you want with it. But I mean, I haven't worn it in a ponytail yet, so I don't know exactly how it looks, but I really like this wig. So I hope you enjoyed this wig review and please like and subscribe.